currently finishing my masters and I do a lot of freelance work so my desk is somewhere I spend a lot of time. That also means that a lot of junk accumulates on my desk but today I cleaned it and I thought to mark this momentous occasion I would take you all on a tour. My desk is mostly made up of my desktop, my pin board and my stack of papers. My pin board is covered in receipts because I always lose them but I can't if they're right in front of my face. There's tickets from movies and festivals I've been to, there's a polo from my road trip to Napier, as well as a photograph of a grumpy old man I picked up in an antique shop. In front of that I have my two proudest achievements, my bachelor's degree and my ducks trophy. My ducks trophy used to be bigger but I had to return the official one and I get to keep this little one. Then there's the dinosaur I got in Thailand, a toy DeLorean I bought in first year, my boyfriend's Rubik's Cube, a Robin figurine from my old flatmate Katie, and the penguins from my film Why the Southern Ocean. My paper stack is almost always full and usually ends up exploding all over my desk. There's books I should be reading for my masters, the zine I made for the poetry club, some notebooks, Christmas cards and letters. Currently living on my desk is the stack of documentaries I rented from our tour house that are also probably overdue. Yes, I do still rent DVDs, but mostly because Auto House is probably the coolest place in Hamilton. My favourite thing on my desk is my candle, which smells super amazing and also once caught my desk on fire, but that's a story for another time. A lot of people might have really minimalist workspaces, but I like my desk. It may look like it's filled with junk from the outside, and some of it is junk, but a lot of it is reminders of really great adventures and achievements I'm really proud of. which. Help me stay motivated and hopefully create new adventures. So if you have a cool desk space, tweet me a photo, I would love to see it. And if you thought this was rad, don't forget to subscribe to see more cool adventures.